Well, hello everybody and welcome back. I'm sorry I haven't made a video in a while, but uh, just want to give you an update. And this is what I have accomplished. Not bad, huh? Now I'm sure you like, what in the world is that? Well, let me go through and uh, kind of show you what I've done. Uh, I have installed the shocks that connects to this plate and this allows the unit to go down and to go up it kinda bounces and that goes all the way around uh, it really hasn't been too hard to put together but you know it's been more of uh between the instructions and the videos like i said in the previous video the only thing that i'm really concerned about is uh let me see if i can back up here is when i turn it like it it makes this weird sound like it'll lock there but it feels like it's off and you can hear it like it's hitting and I can't quite figure out where it's hitting but it, Yeah, so I don't know, but I'm going to talk to tech support about it. Anyway, um, so I am now installing the uh, the brackets that hold the screens right here, and they're held on by uh, these two bolts here. And again, there's four that go all the way around and it's turning out pretty good i've kind of got excuse the mess here but got to kind of got laid everything out here these are the brackets that actually will fit like that and then the screens will go into them uh, but until i can get there I'm trying to figure out next how to mount them. There's a lot of screws here. And I'm hoping that if I count them out right, that this will be the ones. But, but as you can see, we are getting down to it. It is actually coming together uh, I think that I will have it done hopefully the rest of it by tomorrow night and then I can move on to our washout booth and our flash dryer here and then possibly Saturday night on to our exposure unit um, that will be pretty much it after that and then uh, I can start on our printing tutorials but overall this thing I have to say has not been bad like I thought it was because it was very overwhelming when I went to unpack it but it is well built service has been excellent I recommend this to anybody who is doing screen printing whether you're new or you are experienced I actually know somebody who has been in the business for oh 10 years or more and uh, they have a few professional presses and they want to get the shocker to, to try it out so I told them you know this was a place to go and uh, so yeah it's coming together pretty good I did have to go to um, the hardware store today and pick up two bolts that uh, 
I don't know if they were missing or maybe I misplaced them, but they were these. And there was one and two that were missing here, so I just went to the hardware store and picked up two of those, and that was a dollar or something. So, anyway, I will keep you posted, and I want to give a shout out to Mr. Beaver Michael Paul, who has started a new channel. Uh, he does live streaming, uh, typically 8 o'clock he starts, um, so be sure to subscribe. His channel is Beaver, B-E-A-V-E-R, Paul, P-A-U-L, dash, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, yep. Beaver Michael Dash Paul P A U L, and he's trying to get his channel up and going. So you guys, please check him out. He is uh, an individual that, um, very incredible man. And you will have to know just what I'm talking about. You will have to go to his channel and find out just what I'm talking about. So I'm not going to give any surprises away. I will let him do that. But uh, he is very much into chess, and he will be having his first meeting uh, at the library downtown. If you guys know where the area is, you know what I'm talking about. And you can go on his channel and subscribe and ask him questions and find out when, which is usually the first Tuesday. I'm sorry. It's the third, first Tuesday of every month. No, I'm sorry. It's the th first Thursday he changed it of every month. So he wants to do a little live streaming of his chess abilities, which the guy is completely amazing. Um, so please check him out. It is Beaver Michael Dash Paul. That is the name of his channel. And he would love for you to subscribe. So, that's about it, folks. I think we're going to end this live stream, and I will talk to you tomorrow night, and hopefully I will have more of this done, and we can get to business. So, thanks for watching, and I will see you later.